welcome to Wildcat Action News. I'm B, And I'm Samaria. This week, we're starting off with our top story. Let's go there now. Hello. At the end of the week, Wildcats will begin their winter break. After a great first half of the year, all students will have an opportunity to relax and enjoy time at home with family and friends. We stopped around the building to find out how Wildcats plan on spending their time during winter break. Can you tell us about exciting stuff you're going to do in winter break? I'm going to watch a movie with my family. What fun thing are you doing for winter break? I'm going to my grandma's house for Christmas. What exciting things are you doing over winter break? My birthday's coming up on December 23rd and I'm probably going to go out to eat for dinner. What exciting stuff are you going to do in winter break? I will play with my sister. What are you doing for winter break? Every single Christmas we sleep in my brother's room and then we wake up at 1 o'clock in the morning. Then we play video games and, and do Lego. It goes till 6 o'clock and then we go wake up our mom and dad and then we go downstairs to most open presents. What exciting stuff are I going to do on winter break? I'm going to go up north to my grandparents' house, and then after that, I'm going to go to my cousin's house, and then I'm going to go back home to do Christmas, and then play with my friends, and then just have family time. What are you doing for winter break? My family is going to Europe and London and Paris. Wildcats of all ages are excited about the upcoming break. We hope everyone has a great break and comes back to school ready for an amazing second half of the year. So from Wildcat Action News, we want to wish everyone a happy holidays. See you in January. Let's send it back up to the newsroom. Thanks, Top Story Team. Now it's time for this week's Staff Spotlight. Hello, I'm Nightick, and today we're interviewing Mrs. Gillis from this week's Staff Spotlight. How long have you been teaching at Wilder Wake? Um, I have been a kindergarten teacher at Wilder Wake for 12 years, but I've worked here for 13 years. What do you like most about being a teacher? Um, I love the kids. Every year we get new kids that have not been at school before and I love hanging out with them and teaching them how to do school and I love teaching them how to read because they think they can't do it but they actually can and then they get awesome at it. What's your favorite book? Um, my favorite book is The Nightingale. That's my favorite book that I have ever read. Um, for the kids in kindergarten, I love to read them. We don't eat our classmates. <laughs> Um, it's a good rule in my classroom when we read the book so that they remember the rule. What's your favorite food to eat? Um, favorite food, that's kind of a hard one because I like tons of food. I love a good burger and I love pizza. I go with burgers, but if I'm, if I'm thinking about it, I really should have a good salad. I like a good salad full of good stuff. What's your favorite hobby? Um, I would say my favorite hobby is playing golf. Um, I tried knitting but it did not work out too well. And recently my mom gave me my grandpa's mandolin, so maybe next year my favorite hobby will be playing the mandolin. We'll see, we'll see how it goes. Where do you like to go on vacation? Well, I love going on vacation. My um, daughter lives in New York City, so I go, I've go. i been going there pretty frequently to see her. Um, my son is moving to Milwaukee, so I think I'm gonna start doing some vacation time in Milwaukee. And I love to go to Newport, Rhode Island. That's my favorite place in America to go. I've been there about seven times, and I love it there. What's your favorite sports team? Um, my favorite sports team is um, the University of Illinois men's basketball team. I love watching them play basketball. They're awesome and they're fun to watch. Thank you, Mrs. Gillis, for joining us on this week's Staff Spotlight and telling us about yourself. Well, thank you very much. You guys did an awesome job. Let's, Let's send it back, back up to the newsroom.
We are ready to see this week's lunch menu. Let's go to Chef Isa and Chef Nelson. Hello, Wildcats. I'm sure looking forward to Christmas this year. Yeah, I asked for a new spatula. It's going to be awesome. Nice. Let's check out the lunch menu. Today we're going to have a meatball soup. On Tuesday, we're going to have tangerine chicken over rice. On Wednesday, we're going to have homemade beef chili. On Thursday, we're going to have chicken nuggets and our wheat roll. And on Friday, we're going to have cheese pizza bread. I can't wait to get the new spatula. Wait, what did you ask for Christmas? World peace. Oh. Enjoy your lunches. That sounds like some good lunches. We are ready for this week's good news. This is the 5A Good News Crew. We are looking for students who have met all four expectations. Safe, respectful, kind, and responsible. Let's see who we found this week. We are here at 5C interviewing Astrid. What are one of the four expectations you've been meeting? Safe. How have you been safe? By walking in the halls. Good job. We are here at 1L interviewing Wagan. Which one of the four expectations have you been meeting? Responsible. How have you been responsible? I've been picking up trash. That's amazing. We are here at 4JC interviewing Finnan. Which one of the four expectations have you been meeting? Respectful. How have you been respectful? Being a good partner. Good job! We are here at 3H interviewing Sai. What are one of the four expectations you've been meeting? Kind. How have you been kind? I've been letting people play with me. That is some good news! Great job, Wildcats! This has been the 5A Good News Crew. Will, Will we catch, catch you being great? Let's learn a fun fact! Hey Wildcats, time to open this present. Wait, before we do, I have to tell you something. In 2021 in the US, the amount of money spent on Christmas gifts was $886 billion. The average person spends around $826 each Christmas. And that's your fact of the week. See you next year. It's time for this week's quick quiz. Can I get the answer? Let's check out this week's joke of the week. What's green, covered in Christmas lights, and goes ribbit? Mistletoe. That's all the time we have for this week. Thank you for joining us. See you right after winter break, right here on Wildcat Action News. I wonder what Santa's gonna bring me. I do too. Ho, ho, ho. He's here. <coughs> Hello, Wildcats. I'm sure looking forward to Christmas. Yeah, I asked for a new spatula. It's going to be awesome. Let's learn. <laughs> what are we? Okay, what do I say? Relax. <laughs> You're back. Mitchell! <laughs> Levi, it's not your fault. Recording, Riley. Really. Cool.